For reference, I'll be using articles and research papers that were already written in the CFD analysis related to an exhaust manifold. After we open Fluid Flow Sim, we then need to upload our exhaust manifold into the software. Please note that in order for your file to be read by ANSYS software, it needs to be saved as a step file. If you upload it as a SOLIDWORKS part, it will not read it and will consider it as an error. So always save your part as a step file if you want to transfer it to another CAD or CAM software. So when we open Design Modeler, as you can see, we can see our part, but we need to generate it. So we click on generate and as you can see, our part is there. From there, we need to make what is known as an enclosure. <music> 